Hello, ladies and gentlemen, drakes and ducks, humanoids, and their robotic companions. I'm Art Duck, back with you for the first episode of a new Let's Play series on Amorphous Plus. So this is another Flash game. Um, I think that it, or that I think is really quite well made um, by Innocuous Games. Oh, oh, dear. oh, wow, that was, ay, that's scary. Um, I haven't played this game in a while. This game still contains graphic, although cartoony and poorly drawn, violence, and therefore may be unsuitable to viewers who are under the age of 13 or are easily offended. Okay, so this is the game. Hold, hold on a second. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, right. So, instructions of the game. Um, move around towards the cursor. Uh, to attack, left... Um, a to use a special ability, changing songs, quitting game, all good stuff. Um, right, so, how about we go into, um, well, uh, first I better explain what this game is about, I guess, maybe, um, or as I, as I do this, um, this game is, um, you, you play as this little guy that's um, hunting down gloopals, um, which are these little um, green things, and uh, he squ squats them, um, or splats them with uh, his big um, Splatmaster 3000 knife, and um, that's pretty much it, but it gets interesting when you start to see that there are more kinds of bloople than just your basic um, standard uh, green bloople. They'll be coming along any moment. Probably. There we go. That was one of those acidy bloopers. You don't want to step in that because the oh crap, purple, die, die purple, go. Um. So. Uh. Um. It starts to get dangerous because while the greens can't kill you, they can only kind of knock you off your balance a bit. Um, you can you can see that uh, the the orangey ones will well you can you can kind of guess that they would probably kill you if you were to step in their stuff. Oh dear, that's a giant. Oh oh god, um god, j two, three, got him. Okay, got a reward key. Good. Bad. Good, got him. Oh, crap. I did not see that stuff there. Um, right, so... Yeah, this is a... Uh, there's, there gets to be a lot of stuff going on in the screen. Um... So, uh... Right, first episode. I, um... I might want to explain what exactly is going on. Um, maybe the best area can... Uh, can really show you um, what's up with all these with all these things. So this is the glue ball. Um, uh, I figure this is a big wall of text that I can't just read at you. So you can just pause the video on YouTube. I'm going to be looking at each of these for a couple seconds. Um, if you missed that, you can go back. This one, sticky, biter. These are these guys are dangerous bastards. Clutter. These can get dangerous. Boozle. Um, those, yeah, you don't want to take, um... You don't want to try to, uh, destroy it with, um, uh, all, like, from the front while it's bearing down on you. It's, um, that, that wouldn't be good. Anyway, um, right. So now that you've obviously read all that, or not, as you so chose, 
Uh, right, so Amorphous Plus is, you know, a game about guys hunting down these glue bowls. Um, they, they're doing their reverse, reverse os, no, reverse mitosis. Why did I say reverse osmosis? That's something completely different. Um, I guess, uh, in a bit you'll understand some more about the game mechanics. These are rewards, so I earned a reward key. Um, and with that reward key, I would like to buy something good. Uh, let's see. Um, give me a moment. I, I need to figure out exactly um, what I want to what I want to get here. Hold on. Okay, I got it. Um, so. I like to play as more of a defensive sort of, uh, um, I like to play with a more defensive sort of strategy, not so, uh, very aggressive. I'm not that great at aggressive. So, I'm going to buy the hazard suit with, uh, my reward key, um, or not buy, but unlock. Second cousin to both the scuba suit and the cell suit, the hazard suit uses a contained power pack to operate a powerful lattice of disruptive current yielding microfiber woven into a thick protective body suit. While charged, the suit responds to potentially dangerous conditions by a combination of electromagnetic current, insulative coating, and atmospheric filtration. The last word in material hazard evasion. And uh, that's, that's that. Um, I'm just going to equip that right there. So these are, oh, no, these are rewards. Awards. These are things that you can get for doing stuff. Um, like participation. Splatting a Google. Glu uh, sorry, Gloopal. Pretty sure my cat could have gotten that one. Um, get a squid, um, one of those stickies. Get a biter. Um, splat a melty. Splat a clutter. And splat a noodle. Um, right. Then, okay, good. Yeah, you, anyway. So these are achievements, and there are 110 of them. So you try to get as many as possible, and you can unlock more rewards. Different rewards do different things, obviously. And they're, they have varying levels of use. But, uh, each episode of this, um, of this playthrough, or more like Let's Play, since it's going to be going on for a, s or a good solid amount of time, there's no real end to the game much, I don't think, so uh, why don't I just, um, as for the single nets, I'm, and as I'm just going to be going through these, um, first small, see if I can get through them, then go big, and then go huge. Uh, anyway, small nest, let's go. Obviously I have, I have this hazard suit on me now, and it's it's helping me out well it's not obvious it's helping me out or how it's helping me out now at this point but I assure you that it is well um, new good splat and good so what the hazard suit does is it protects me against various, um, well, material hazards like that acid melty thing, and um, the uh, the stickiness of the stickies, and well, basically everything. Um, it has a limited amount of charge to it, so you can't expect it to protect you forever. Oh crap! Get, gotcha. Gotcha. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> take that. Um, take that. And that. And I hate you bastards. Go die in a fire. Splat. Good. And so I am, um, as you can see on the lower left, that I am slowly getting rid of all the gloopals in this gloopal nest. And if you, I don't know if you caught that, but um, when I splatted the purple gloopal, 
or no, I, when I got hit by the purple blue ball, my hazard suit um, took care of the mess. That was good. So, um, yeah. Oh dear, that's that's a bit getting a bit close to the. Oh geez, spiders are scary. Um, I don't want to get into the melty piles. Here, split. And get out of the way. Gold Man Tucker. Oh crap. And 471, 81 globals left. So I was killed. There are fireworks. Or my dead body. Um, oh dear. So uh, I think every every episode, I think it would be um, nice to get in um, two single nest runs or attempts and one bounty run. Uh, I'll just keep them keep them nice and short because this um, this game it's you know it, it's all about the runs and well, oh oh god that sounded bad no no not the runs but anyway let's try a bounty run. Um, I'll go difficulty ramp slow. And I'll, I'll switch the difficulty ramps uh, when I switch the nest uh, levels, okay? Um, right. So, this is a bounty run, so it's endless, and I just get points. There are no, there's no end to all the glue pulls. So I just try to do my best, try to kill as many as possible. As efficiently as possible. Take that all year. And that. Ha. Um, let's see, how shall we do this? Yeah, okay. So I'm, I'm doing things pretty well so far. In 74. 74 is a decent score. Maybe the difficulty ramp of slow is a bit too slow. Possibly. Well, I've survived for, a sur for some length of time. That's good, I guess. Oh dear. Oh dear lord. Oh crap. Crap a Rooney. Crapatology. Craporific crapatology crapination. Oh schnitzel bombs. What in the name of What in the name of shit schnitzel bombs? Gotcha! Haha! -ha. Take that, you bastard! Oh god, look at that! Look at what that did to my hazard suit number left. It's halfway drained. But if I hadn't um, hadn't had my hazard suit on, I would have gotten sucked into that uh, vortex too many or several times over. So uh, what just happened there was a case of uh, reverse mitosis. Um, so first two glooples bumped together to form an, uh, a, a, an oozle, then an oozle bumped with another gloozle, to, uh, sorry, gloople, to form a, um, one of those iron ones, or spiky, or spiny, or something, um, some name like that. Pretty self-explanatory. Basically, they increase in density and complexity as they do the reverse uh, uh, mitosis. It's pretty bad. Um, you don't want to get in their way, but uh, when they when they when another one um, when another glupal hits the um, the steel spiky one, it forms like this gravity one. And it's it's bad. It's very bad. It is all kinds of bad. Well, not all kinds of bad, but most kinds of bad. Oh dear. Oh no. No, no, no. Don't, don't knock me off balance like that. You bastard. Um. So these... As you can probably tell, these 
uh, acid light puddles things can be a blessing in in um, or a, a boon to you since they can slow down enemies that might otherwise hit your face too quickly like biters like there um, so I, I'd say I'm managing this here take that you um, right I'll survive for a good long amount of time I'm, I'm doing a good job with this I think maybe no I'm, I'm actually kind of slight, only slightly above it. oh no I'm below average in that respect oh see see what happens um, when you walk through a puddle of that sort of stuff it, it, um, it drains your hazard suit but it keeps you from experiencing any ill effects from it love the hazard suit couldn't live without it would have died by now, certainly. Can't be dying, dying's no good. Like, seriously, dying is dying sucks, you don't wanna die. At least I don't wanna die. I don't know about you. You might wanna die loads. You you could love dying. But I don't know. I don't wanna die. Here we go. You. Um you're not allowed to continue existing. And Oh, crap. And my hazard suit ran out of me because I um, got, you know, when it directly runs into it and you get a concentrated dose, that really puts a serious drain on your hazard suit. Um, so let's go into the bestiary and look at those. Um, correct me if I'm pronouncing it wrong. Maybe it's bestiary. Sorry, um, I, I wouldn't know. Anyway, so the, oh, right, gray. Um, further mutual absorption. Um, or da-da-da. It's, it has, um... Let's see. It has certain capacities, um, which are dangerous. In fact, um, I think better than, you know, uh, so, I mean, you can pause the video to see what it does. Um, I think a best, uh, the better way would be to go practice against it. Um, right. So, this is a gray. And, um, what can I, okay. Got it. Okay, that's how you defeat them. So you have to take a smack at them after they've, they're at, while they're extending their thing with jibu what's it at you. Their long protrusion. Okay, now, now I have a better idea of how to get rid of them. And they have three hit points, just like the just like oozers. Um, here, exit practice mode. Practice against a void eater. See if we see what we can do. Um, oh well, that was that was no good. What? What? Come on, stupid Void Eater. What are you doing, Void Eater? Stupid Void Eater. Don't make me come up and... Oh. Oh, crap. Well, now I understand what it... Okay, so... Um... You... Bam! Take that. Take that, you bastard. Sweat. You only have one hit point. No, okay, so when they when they do that core thing, that's when you want to get the hell out of their way, because they your um your hazard suit won't save you in that instance. But um that should give you an idea of what they do. Um and then Actually, biters. Biters, they do, um, well, no, no, no. I, I need to save some stuff, um, for you for, um, for the matter of, uh, future episodes. 
so um, I'm not going to spoil everything about the game, but there are some pretty cool things that can go on in this game. Um, I'm giving you a pretty hint, a huge hint through just what I'm doing right now in this practice mode. But, um, anyway, uh, I think it would be wise for me to end the episode here, actually. Um, and so, uh, I, right, so what, what do I say? I say, um, leave a like if you like the video, subscribe if you like the channel, leave a comment, comments, questions, complaints, cons concerns, leave them in the comments section below. Um, positive, negative feedback, constructive uh, criticism, or or destructive. Um, if you want to say anything, leave it in, in the comment section below. Um, and otherwise, just uh, um, have a nice day. Duck out. Bye now. Oh, crap. No, no, no. I'm too young to die.